Hey guys, this is Aaron Tebow from Pete's RV Center, South Burlington, Vermont. Today I want to walk you through the 2017 J Flight 23 RB. Let's back up, get you a full shot of the camper here. It's awesome couples camper, perfect size, smaller, but also has everything and all the packages you want to go on a nice trip. Um, right up top, in front here, you're going to see a power tongue jack. No more cranking up and down on your vehicle, just easy access up and down. It also comes with a docking light, an LED one, just in case it's you know super early in the morning or a little late at night, you can help yourself see. Also, you settle into the campsite after a few days, so having that auto level just up and down to readjust hit is a perfect thing to have. Right here, you have upgraded 30 pound tanks um, with a cover. This LP protector is gonna keep your tanks from rusting with also quick access so you can get in here and see where your gauges are and check everything in. Right back here, you're gonna see a spot for two batteries. Um, that's great for people who are dry camping. Um, it extends their trip. You know, if you're going a few hours away for a camping trip, you wanna be there as long as possible. So having two battery spots is awesome. You're gonna see this nice diamond plate rock guard right here. Anything kicking up from your uh, vehicle, just gonna bounce off that, not damage the nice aluminum siding you have right here. Um, you also have right there that frame is an integrated A-frame. That means it goes all the way through here and inside. Most manufacturers just cut it off and weld it here. This beam actually goes all the way through. So it's very helpful to know. It's Jayco. Jayco is a very proud building company. They don't mess around. They build everything the highest quality. I've been to the factory and I was very impressed with everything that they do there. Right up front here, you're gonna see a nice storage spot. It's pass through storage. Goes all the way to the other side. Uh, there's a box in here, but it also goes all the way around. And I have an LED light in here. It gives us a little light so you can see how deep it is. I'll show you that it's also accessible from the bed. The gas struts are right there. I'll show you that in just a minute. Another thing to note on this side, tinted windows on this guy that's good for privacy as well as hot summer days the sun's just gonna reflect off it and the UV rays aren't gonna warm your camper up as much next thing that's obviously gonna catch your eye powered awning as well as powered LED light strip um, it's great lighting it's cheap you know and uh, it doesn't mess with your power it's gonna take less electricity actually the inside is built with LED lights as well um, not hot to the touch and saves on your battery if you dry camping right there you're gonna see two speakers for outside. Um, the inside controls, you can turn that on whenever you want. So say you're just hanging out outside on a nice warm day, play some music to hang out. Also, if it's hot, right in this back storage compartment, you have this right here, but you also have a little mini fridge for drinks and other things. So you don't have to walk all the way inside just to get a nice cold beverage on a hot day. Another feature that's been added in, a nice um, ladder right there to get to the top of your roof. You wash it off, clean it, or just check out if anything's up there. It's very nice to have. You have spare tire with cover, as well as a utility shower right here. See a hose right here, it'll come out and you can rinse yourself off. Maybe you've been hiking or you're super dirty after a long day. You don't wanna walk inside and get it all dirty. You can just rinse yourself off easily right there. All right, now let's head inside, show you a few nice features in there. 23 RV. Number one selling travel trailer, J-Flight. They make it like no other. Oversized grab handle right here. Helps anybody with a, you know, a bad hip or getting up and in. It's just an easy way, a more safer way to get inside. All right, let me give you a quick pan through. Bedroom, sofa, kitchen, bathrooms behind that door, and then your dining right there. So let's start over here in the bathroom, I mean the bedroom I should say. Um, you have a mirrored construction all the way around for storage. It's not just a shelf up here. A lot of units you'll see they'll cut that out to save money and space and uh, weight. You can you actually have, with glass inserts up here too, actual storage all the way through. As well as right there. You'll see on the sides, on both sides you have a nice um, nightstand with a charging center, 12 volt and USB charging, as well as outlets. Um, you can see right here, a little bit of information on it. Super nice to have um, if you're trying to power up your electronics to show off to all your friends on social media about how your trip's going. Same thing on this side. LED lights, that one's just not on. 
push of a button, super bright, very, um, doesn't just, like I said earlier, it doesn't take away from your batter as well. All right, next you'll see this sofa, it's a jackknife, very comfortable, very soft, goes down to create a bed just in case, um, you know, you're out with your friends and they need to spend the night, you're looking to do that, they can stay over without a problem. Maybe grandkids as well, because also this dinette you have over here is also going to drop down. And it's not the ones with, uh, you can see down here, it actually lowers itself. It's not on the pegs, the pedestals there. You can actually lower this down and bring it outside if you want. That's also a great benefit of this kind of table. And it's very large. You know, for having two people in here, it's a large, large table and a dinette, which is almost as big as the ones in the bunkhouses for the family. So that's also a great thing you have in here. Next, you have a bunch of cabinetry up over here. Plenty of room to bring all the pots and pans you want. Uh, if you're going on a long trip, maybe to see some other states that you haven't been to before, it's good to have all that storage space with you. Um, right here, stainless steel appliances. See that here? And your fridge. Residential microwave, just like the one you have in your house. You got the popcorn button on it. You see it right there. Has everything you need. Three burner stove cooktop, as well as oven underneath. Next, you have your Norcold fridge. Now this is a great fridge, well-known brand. It also has the auto feature right here. So when you're plugged in to both electricity and uh, gas, auto is always gonna take electricity, but for some reason you lost power at the campsite, it's gonna know to switch over to gas and save everything you have in here. So, you know, maybe you have a few hundred dollars worth of food in here, it's gonna save that and you're not gonna lose it. And what's helpful to know about this fridge is it's large to fit lots of food in here because it's an upgraded eight cubic foot fridge for your standard six. So it's very nice to know and to have with you for long trips. Your sink split right here so you can do two things at once. Very nice, very large. Pull out faucet right here so you can get into those pots and pans. Down here you have some drawers, four sided drawers in this. Sometimes manufacturers will cut out the back side and it's all real wood very very strong sturdy um, drawers there they're actually on 75 pound tested ball bearings which is awesome to know you can put a lot of stuff in there up top you have a skylight huge skylight with a shade just in case you don't want that you can move that out it's huge too lights up the whole area giving you some more natural light Furion TV same as the speakers that you saw outside as well as this Here's where you control all your music and all that stuff. Um, it is Bluetooth, so you can connect to it wirelessly through maybe your phone, an iPad, or anything like that. You got some big storage up here. And some storage you might not know about. Down under both of these dinettes, you have a large storage with a tote. So you fill the totes out and then just slide it in. Instead of having to get on your hands and knees and get way down under there, you can just slide it back in super nice super easy to do next moving on to the bathroom you have a lot of space in here Look at all the leg room you're not cramped in here at any point you have a large tub with surround um, skylight at the top it's not just the wall piece in here you actually have the tub surround which is nice uh, foot flush toilet right there you see the foot flush you have actually large counter space for the sink and a medicine cabinet. A lot of places just have um, a mirror for you. This has the whole nine yards. You got storage in here and you got storage up here. Very nice. And my favorite part about this whole camper, like I said, it's a nice couples camper. You can go on long trips together, you, but you need a lot of storage. Look at the size of this closet. In the bathroom, wraps all the way around. I mean, I can't even touch the wall and I'm in it. Just barely. You got the bar to hang things. That is huge to bring everything you need. That way you're not picking and choosing the items you want to bring with you for a long trip. You can just bring them all and uh, use them as you please. If you have any questions on this camper, uh, please let me know. It's got no slides, obviously, as you noticed. I should have mentioned that earlier. Um, if you are looking for a little more room in here, we do have a 24 RBS, which is almost identical to this floor plan, but has a slide out right in this area right here. So... Um, like I said, if you have any questions, please contact me. My name is Aaron Tebow, Pete's RV Center, South Burlington, Vermont. And uh, thanks for watching, guys.